ஹாய் ஐ மீனாட் சுந்தரம் என்னோடய நண்பர் மிஸ்டர் சங்கர் என்னோடய இருபது ஆண்டு கால நண்பர் அவர் மேக்ஸ் ரொம்ப எளிமையாகவும் ஈஸியாகவும் டீச் பண்ணுவார் அது எல்லாருக்கும் ரீச் ஆகணுன்றதுக்காண்டி எடுத்த முயற்சி தான் இது தேங்க்ஸ் டுடே ஐம் கோயிங் டு டாக் அபவுட் ஏரியா யூஸிங் டபுள் இன்டெக்ரேஷன் யூ மே ஆல் நோ த ஏரியா ஆஃப் த ரீஜன் விச் இஸ் ரெக்டாங்கிள் ஆஃப் லென்த் எல் அண்ட் பிரெத் பி இஸ் நத்திங் பட் லென்த் அண்ட் பிரெத் டுடே இன் திஸ் விஷுவல் கம்யூனிகேஷன் ஐ ஆம் கோயிங் டு ப்ரெசென்ட் ஹவு வி கெட் த ஏரியா ஆஸ் லென்த் இன் டு பிரெத் ஃபார் எ ரெக்டாங்கிள் ஸோ வி ஷெல் கோ டு த போர்ட் area of the region say capital r is equal to double integral over the region r dx dy this region r which i am going to ex- explain today is the rectangle whose length is l and breadth is b in the cartesian coordinate system we have two axes one is x axis we call it x axis line as y equal to 0 the y axis as the line x is equal to 0 for this is the origin 0,0 now i am going to take a length l units in the right side positive side of the quadrant so this point will be l distance from the origin so this is l comma zero if i try to write draw the line this line will be represented as the equation x is equal to l this is x is equal to zero this is l distance therefore this line is x is equal to l similarly i am going to take a b distance right a b distance say this is going to be the b b distance from the origin so if i draw a line here if i draw a line here this line is y equal to 0 which is b units up therefore this is y is equal to obviously this point is 0 comma b now we have a region a rectangular region this region i'll just denote it as r now i am interested in finding the area of this particular region r using the double integration let us see how what is required so what is required number 1 strips to cover the region r strips to cover the region r number 2 finding the limits finding the limits for both x and y the last one is number 3 evaluation of the integral this is a double integral so the evaluation of integral 
so these three things are required to find the area of the region R first we see how to find the strip or what is actually a strip is now I have to cover this region R using a strip for example I am going to take a strip like this which I am going to call it as Y1 Y2 <coughs> reason is simply it is parallel to the Y equal to 0 line which is the X axis I am naming it as a strip Y1 and Y2 let us uh, take the region how this strip will cover the entire region R just assume that this region as a cake you have a knife which is the cutting portion is Y1 and Y2 where will you cut first the first cut will be on the line y equal to 0 then you move the strip parallel to the x-axis and the last cut will be at the line y is equal to b so if we keep on moving the strip from the starting portion y equal to 0 and if you move to y is equal to b this region r will be covered by the strip y1 and y2 right similarly this is uh, also can be achieved by taking an another alternative strip say for example x1 x2 i'm just taking a line this is uh, x2 this is x1 note that these two strips are actually perpendicular right now the same region can be covered using the strip x1 x2 but one thing the cut will be from here the line x is equal to 0 and you cut it cut it cut it and the last cut will be on the line x is equal to l so the reason why I have been cho chosen x1 and x2 is actually this strip is parallel to the line x is equal to 0 or I can say that this is the y axis here the, I, I already told that the name y1 y2 is some other strip which is parallel to the line y equal to 0 I have been taken that there is nothing wrong with it now the strips to cover the region R can either be Y1, Y2 or it can be X1, X2. So you can choose any strip which is suitable for you to cover the particular region. Now let us take uh, the strip Y1 and Y2 first and let us see how to find the limits for X and Y. Consider the strip y1 y2 to find x limits the strip y1 touches the curve x is equal to 0 so I just write at y1 at y1 x is equal to 0 Similarly, at Y2, so the limits for X is 0 to L. At the same time, how to find the limits for Y? To find Y limits.
So I have taken the strip Y1, Y2. This is the line, strip line. To cover the region R, this Y1, Y2 should be moved from Y equal to 0 to Y is equal to B. As I mentioned that if you consider it as a cake, it should be the first cut will be on the line y equal to 0 and last cut will be at y equal to b. So therefore the limit says y is equal to 0 to y is equal to b. So considering the strip y1 y2 we have the limits x is equal to 0 to l and y is equal to 0 to b. Now coming to the double integration part coming to the double integration part we already seen that area of the region R is equal to double integral over the region R dx dy now this region r will be bounded by the limits x is equal to 0 x is equal to l y is equal to 0 y is equal to b therefore i can substitute the x limits and the y limits here as this is equal to i can write it as x is equal to 0 to x is equal to L, y is equal to 0 to y is equal to B. Here dx dy. So the second step is over finding the limits over then the last part is evaluation of the integral which is very simple look at here this is constant this is constant so this is constant limits therefore it can be written as integral x is equal to 0 to x is equal to l dx the product y is equal to 0 to y is equal to b dy we know that the evaluation of the integral dx is x taken over from the limit 0 to l so this is equal to this is equal to after integration dx will become x taken over the limits 0 to l product integral of dy is y taken over the limits 0 to b. Now going for the limit substitution upper limit minus lower limit which is equal to the upper limit is substitution for x is equal to l is l minus the lower limit is 0 substitution for x is equal to 0 here the upper limit for y is b replace y as b minus the lower limit is 0 so we have l here multiplied by b here so the area of the rectangular region we have seen r is equal to length into breadth which is a square units.